Doo doo vlog bitches. Procrastination. I should be editing videos. Or filming. I don't know. I need help. What's up my dudes? I just got out the shower. These are not outside clothes. Don't try me. I keep my bed clean. Um, but yeah, it is Friday or something. I don't even know. I decided that I don't know what I want to post. So I'm just going to vlog and yeah, let's just hope that this goes well. I had plans to like go and hang with somebody. I've never met this person, but I've met this person at the same time. Like we went to school together. Yeah, we've always bumped shoulders with like certain friend groups and stuff, but we've never hung out and we decided to go and get some drinks and paint. I don't know if we're, that's gonna fall through because she has a baby and she gets off of work at around like five or so and I'm pretty sure she's gonna wanna hang with her kid. I don't blame her. Yeah, by the time I'm kinda ready to do some stuff, she might not be ready or she just might cancel altogether, which is completely cool. Yeah, either way, your girl is about to get into something tonight because I need, I need a vacation. I was supposed to take a vacation this weekend actually, but then Daniel got called into work and I didn't want to go anywhere by myself because I'm weird with traveling by myself. I'm scared that like, I'm gonna get abducted by one of those like um, Jesus cults. You know what I'm talking about? Like those people that be like, oh, this is a church organization. Why don't you come and pop that pee meow for Jesus and now you're in human trafficking. Like, no, no ma'am. So yeah, I am gonna get into something tonight and i'm about to go get ready and even if i don't go anywhere i'm probably gonna pick up like a bottle or something and do like a review or something that i haven't drank before and just like record that but yeah today's goal get more comfortable with holding your camera outside i feel like i'm in like this weird place of like being like in the middle of like millennial and like gen z i think it i'm pretty sure it's gen z like i'm in that weird spot where it's like yeah my job involves me talking to a camera but i won't be caught dead talking to a camera outside my house and I need to get over that. Doo doo vlog bitches. Whoa. I'm about to walk my dog and I didn't want to lay my wig and then oh my god what the fuck. I didn't want to lay my wig and then walk the dog because I wanted to lay my wig do my makeup. This needs to be like rubbed down with alcohol and stuff and like yes yeah, so my trick is when you just need to run out real quick and this should just be a very universal no univer universally known trick throw a beanie on that bitch bitch vlog failure oh my god right, we're just gonna set you right here hopefully you don't fall i'm just trying to put my damn beanie on i'm over here breaking the whole freaking building there we go like whenever you do this trick just be ready for people to give you strange looks because if you're anything like me and you wear tank tops and beanies you're gonna get strange looks all right, I'm sorry, let's go. Ooh, I need to clean all these shoes up when I get back. No, I do not wear socks with slip-ons, okay? It's for two freaking seconds. My feet are not going to stink. Don't try it. I'm saying a quick prayer that this lady is not outside trying to talk to me today. This is so weird but I have to get used to it or else. Okay, so good news, that lady is not freaking out here today, so I don't have to be bothered with like weird ass questions. Well, that was a relief. So check this out, I ordered this off of Amazon. I thought these were gonna come with plants inside and it's just the planter. I mean, they're cute, they're cute little planters, but like I wanted them to already have the plants on the inside. What the fuck? Then I ordered this thing. I started a project when I was like manic as shit this morning and now I don't even want to finish it. But it's like a, a wall mount thing, which I already broke. Oh my God. While I was also manic, I bought a whole bunch of shit. Um, I bought like these little tea light cases and then I found a gray salt lamp and I thought that was so cool. Daniel told me to turn this on so I can get out my feelings, get some good vibrations up in here. It doesn't light up as much, but I still think it's dope. Go eat some food, bruh. Where is the best lighting in this bitch? I am about to go upstairs and do this freaking hair. Do do vlog, bitches. My hair is looking cray cray. It's like I was torn between doing my hair like this or having this gray bob, but my bob is not cut correctly right now. And I feel like it was just a little bit too like minimal for my outfit. Your girl needs to start doing some sit-ups again because this is getting ridiculous. 
Anyway, so yeah, I decided to do this. I don't know why I'm holding this, but look at my eyebrows. Holy oh, shit, bitch. What the fuck? So yeah, I'm in the process. I'm a process, okay? Do do vlog, bitches. Do do vlog, bitches. I am so tired. I'm having a day, guys. Oh yeah, today was stupid as shit. As you guys can see, I'm looking a hot ass mess. And I was forced to go out in public like this. Y'all, you know how like you love somebody and you live with them, but you need like a day or like a night or just something where they're not there because they got on your fucking nerves. It's really rare when my boyfriend gets on my nerves to the point where I want to be by myself, but he did that shit today. And I'm so glad he has work because it's super petty. It's a super petty ass argument. But basically what happened was is I thought he had work at 7 a.m. this morning I wake him up at 7 like 8 ish actually because my body clock just noticed that something was wrong But still he was still at the in bed next to me at like 8 o'clock So I'm like bro, you gotta go to work Like I tried to wake him up at 7 8 o'clock and I was like dude like you gotta go to work and he was like Oh, no, I don't have to go to work actually and blah 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 now he does this thing sometimes where like he'll get his schedule changed and then he'll be like oh I don't gotta go to work I quit my job and then gets me all riled up and shit oh I quit my job I don't gotta go to work and I'm just like so now I'm up okay <laughs> so now I'm awake so I'm up and I'm just trying to you know make sure like if an alarm goes off or something that he can be at work because I know he didn't quit because he does that to me all the time like you know what <sighs> by this time it's 11 o'clock so before I go to bed, like, let me ask him, like, when are we going to pay the rent? We have to pay the rent today. My bank closes at four. His bank is at the beat. So obviously he's going to have more of a leeway to go and cash a check. So I'm like, are you trying to go and pay rent at around like 11 o'clock? Because, you know, I get it. You want to sleep in if your schedule change. I get it. He was just like, no, I'm, I don't want to, blah, blah, blah. I know he would sleep. And when he's still asleep, he be saying some real stuff. Like, I know these aren't your words. This is that demon you got up inside you, Brad, that be coming out when you be drowsy. Like, this shit's not normal, but... <laughs> and that's 11 o'clock. So this is my second time trying to wake you up. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna go to bed for a little bit. But my body naturally wakes me back up at around, like, 1 o'clock. I know he has to be at work clocked in at 3. So my body wakes me up naturally around, like, 1. So I'm, I ask him again. I'm like, hey, like, are you ready to get up yet so we can go and pay the rent? He was like, no, like, I'm still asleep. I still want to sleep. And I was like, when are you going to wake up? And he talking about never. I'm like, okay. So at this point, I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna hit up the landlord or he's most likely gonna hit up the landlord. I go back to sleep because I'm like, fuck it. If you don't care, I don't care. I'm about to sleep in. Today is my day off. It's on Monday. I'm about to sleep in. I literally, it felt like I closed my eyes. I'm getting woken up by him being like, oh, we gotta go, we gotta go. I'm like, what? Like, he's real hyper. We gotta go. We gotta go pay rent. We gotta go. It's two o'clock. It's two o'clock. I've been trying to get you up since nine fucking a.m. to go pay the rent. Now it's two o'clock. You're waking me up. My bank closes in two hours. Like, you're rushing me. So I'm just like, fuck. So I literally just threw on some Mitch Mash shit. My hair was looking like this. And I'm irritated as fuck. And I'm like, bro, like, we might as well just pay that shit tomorrow. No, like, you need to, um, we need to go and pay the rent. We need to pay the rent. We can't be irresponsible. We gotta pay the rent. I'm like, boy. So I just stopped talking to him. You got me looking fucking crazy up at the fucking um, bank. People over here looking at my hair know I'm looking crazy. Like, what the fuck, bruh? That is what I am upset about today. And you know what? I'm grateful that that's my only little mediocre ass 
issue. I'm just not gonna talk to him for a few hours because that really fucking irritated me. <laughs> All that rushing and shit, like it was just stupid. And I think the reason why I got so mad is because he was like laughing when I was explaining to him like how inconsiderate he was being and like he just laughing. So I'm like, okay, babe, you think that's funny? That's great. It's my day off. I'm about to just be chilling today. I really wish that I would have vlogged like two days ago because I went out to um, Beach Bar with my friends and that shit was really fucking funny. But my phone died so I couldn't record shit. And yeah, it was it was fun. But we're most likely going out again this weekend. So maybe I'll vlog that. Today, I'm not really doing shit. I'm working on my second channel today. Made a completely new channel that is completely unrelated to everything that I'm doing. I didn't want it to have to be involved with something I was already doing. So I just started from scratch and made a new channel and I'm working on that today. Even though it's my day off, I consider that as fun. I'm gonna be doing some vegan cooking today. I don't know what I wanna cook though. Got a lot of vegan shit. I'm actually being serious about this vegan shit. And then I found out my um, homegirl Chelsea is going vegan. So that's cool. So now I have somebody else that I can like talk to and talk about tips and stuff like that with like the body is oh shit bitch i almost knocked over my little potters i've yet to put any plants in here but the body is snatched the body is getting snatched sis okay we got a visible waistline again but my little pouch got smaller and my butt is still flat so <laughs> the vegan diet has done for me in the span of like um what is it like two three weeks two or three weeks a lot of people advise me not to go cold turkey i mean i did and i didn't at the same time because i already didn't um don't eat a lot of uh meats like i don't eat red meats and i haven't eaten red meats in a long ass time i mainly eat fish chicken and turkey that was like my main thing giving up meat wasn't hard for me giving up cheese was hard so i went out and i got these um vegan cheese substitutes and they taste like popcorn i don't know if they made them out of corn but it tastes like popcorn like it tastes like actual cheese so that's what i so in a way i went cold turkey but in a way i didn't at the same time right now in the fridge i have vegan spaghetti and meatballs that i made for myself i ate like most of it but it's vegetable noodles super greens because i'm not um gluten free but i just love pasta a lot and like that is the source of my weight gain at one point in time because I was overdoing pasta. So I got these super green pastas and then I have um, vegan meatballs. Use these meatballs, meatless. I need to organize these Polaroids. I'm fucking this up too, bruh. Vegan meatballs and then just regular tomato sauce. Easy ass meal and you feel like you're not missing out on much. So yeah, today I'm pretty much just gonna be chilling. Ain't shit about to be going on. Um, I'll show you guys what I cook if I do end up cooking and I most likely will cause I'm probably gonna end up finishing that spaghetti today and then probably make myself some dinner. I really wish Daniel would've finished his spaghetti so that I could've made something for like both of us and not just me. Look at me still caring even though. He did me so dirty this morning. Um, sorry, my house is a fucking mess. I'm doing laundry. I'm just doing all the chores right now because I finally have the house to myself for a long ass time. So that's gonna be cool. So it's just gonna be a girl's day, right, bitch? Do do vlog, bitches. I still haven't posted this vlog, so I guess I'm just gonna end the vlog. I don't know what this vlog was supposed to be. Check out my site. My site. My set. It's like so not cute on camera, but it looks so cute in real life, but it's like ugly. It looks cute at certain angles. Like it's so ugly. It needs so much work. I just don't know what though, but it needs something. Let me know in the comments if you know what it needs. So yeah, I'm gonna end this vlog. I'm like so trash at vlogging as you guys can see. Well, that's pretty much it. Peace. <laughs>